to warm up and get ready to play in between sets. There's plenty of entertainment for the fans. I just love watching Roger hit a few balls, don't they? It's such a warm reception when he was out here practicing earlier today. So One minute. Scenario there. He hasn't played a lot of tennis, so that's the, the problem. He's been practicing hard, but he hasn't had a lot of match time. <laughs> He's thrown in the deep end here. to then step out there on court and play as well as you did against a 14-time Grand Slam champion. Yeah, I did play well. I mean, obviously, uh, Pete was very, very sluggish and he, he uh, struggled with this court. It's a tricky court to play on. And uh, I actually served really well. I mean, Robbie, I, I, we, we spoke in the gym yesterday afternoon because he's just got a third body and that's all I'm going to do for the next <laughs> four matches. I think you've played well in the vast majority of your sort of singles matches since perhaps the first one, but some of your opponents have played lights out, haven't they? I felt that way, but I just maybe think that I'm just beyond this game. You know, maybe these, these old guys just start to get to me now. That's the way I start feeling. Um, you know, the game sort of left me behind in the senior ranks. Um, but that's okay, you know, I'll keep trying. That's all I'm going to do is try my best and see what happens. Robbie. Pat, Robbie here. I think you're still uh, a bit off in the old dog yet. <laughs> but um, tell us a little bit about your new role within uh, Tennis Australia now, uh, stepping up, uh, l overseeing everything. Yeah, mate, um, running high performance of um, Tennis in Australia. So uh, that's uh, it's a really big job. It's all the time, boys and girls, all the way, uh, all the way uh, from age 12, all the way through to the senior ranks. And that's also encompasses all the strength, conditioning, physios. It's a mm -hmm. really massive role. I've got to surround myself with some really good people. And Pat, tell me what it's like when you come from a big federation like uh, you know, Tennis Australia. You've got so much money at your disposal. How do you find that balance between trying to give the players uh, enough financial aid, but not give them too much at the same time, trying to make them hungry and keep them hungry? Yeah, Robbie, that's a great question, mate. And I think in the past, 
Serena came in, she could kind of sit on the bench, soak up the atmosphere, and, and realize that it's not easy for anybody. And then she played a lot better yesterday, and I think you know, she's had an opportunity to use the format and is a little more relaxed now out there on the match court. inspired tennis throughout the competition got an excellent average 5.29 coming into this set here's uh Sanil Gavaskar he averaged uh, over 50 didn't he in the test cricket that's not bad and uh, it's all change here it's the DBS Singapore Slammers who are struggling for games. The Michael Max Indian Aces lead 3 love. Look at the score overall. 6 5 now. Three love. That's 
key. And you are a little tucky cut. You've got to be active early on. You've got to get the feet moving, make some crosses. all the time. They did a lot of crossing in the Davis Cup doubles, didn't they? Played really well. Yep. The high formation here. Oh, you can make once you get down on his knees. There's no double faulting, is there? <laughs> That's on. Will be a first yellow for Sanya. race, Jason. I'm sorry to say. I think Sanya's got two more followers and fans uh, than the international population. And it's uh, hard sometimes for us to comprehend coming from Europe just how big India is and how huge those sports and superstars become. Uh, there's so few women as well that have excelled at the highest level, like Sanya. Again, the divide formation. Touch. Oh. So that will be a, a relief for Sanya. So it's nice to hold you, sir. And uh, a quick timeout calls by the DBS Singapore Slums. Just got to slow things down at the moment. I'll bring it, I'll bring it in the big dog. The big I mean, dog. It's possible that we're going to get Nick Kyrgios in here, given that Bruno is struggling. I'd like to see that. Well, look, mate. Come on, Nick. Nick, go. Come on, mate. Get out, get out there and serve big, OK? Come on. Every game we can get is big. Yeah, we're changing. We've got to stay, stay here for a little bit. Oh, mate. Good intensity out there, huh? Yeah. So Bruno Suarez has been yanked, and in yeah. comes Nick Kyrgios. All right. Be nice for Nick to get warmed up, actually, because remember, oh. playing doubles next with Leighton Shoot against yeah. the Federal right, let's, let's go. Come on, let's go. So come that's on, a, a big doubles match. We're looking forward to that one. Ladies and gentlemen, Federal seems to be striking a ball very well so far. Nick Kyrgios to win Bruno Suarez. In comes Nick Kyrgios, then. And he will serve. And he's certainly not going to treat Federer lightly, that's for sure. Sit in. Roger's got hit it and keep coming forward. Four Some good juice on that first surf. Slammers. 
the Michael Hacks Indian Aces who lead 5 0. It's 7 6 now overall. Oh, you like the ball boy, huh? <laughs> I like everything so bad. Mixed. Great. Mixed. Great. Mixed. Great. 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 a new experience for Rogers. It's always nice to come with it, experience that together. Oh yes, wonderful feeling. Of course Rogers kind of loves his talents, but he's to get his opinion on what he thinks of the format and the competition overall. He is a, a real tennis aficionado, isn't he? And he doesn't only watch Rogers matches. That's the nice thing about Robbie. He watches all the other players. Gets a real joy in seeing how they play their tried. Le dos, les jambes, ok, pas de problème, je vais prévenir Gaël. Sonia, could you introduce us to your new mixed doubles partner? Yeah, um... Yeah, he just asked me to play Australian Open with him. <laughs> We're going to look forward to seeing that on Rod Laver Arena. Roger, welcome to Delhi. Welcome to India. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Uh, yeah, very special to be here. Uh, incredible stadium. Great fans. Uh, I've always wanted to come play tennis here, so I'm happy this is the moment. Thank you, guys. You've heard about it. You've talked to the other players. What was the feeling like when you walked out here onto this court? Special, great ovation, and I really appreciate it. Uh, 
that's why you, you train hard for and that's why you, I love this game for playing in arenas like this around the world and uh, thanks for the special reception today. It was special. Before I let you go, when was the last time you played mixed doubles? It's been a while. Um, I remember playing with, I, I think I played three times with Martina Hingis, Martina Navratilova and my wife. So, so, and now Sanya. So we've done really well. They have been blessed to have a great partner. Roger, Sadia, well done. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, thanks. Well, that's a pretty decent partner down here, isn't he, as far as the mixed doubles.